super excited, very honored. Uh, it's a very coveted list and I'm um, just feeling very good about it. To me, power means uh, energy, the ability to harness and um, kind of navigate collective energy uh, to bring out the best in everybody and then kind of move forward. So really, I mean, it's energy where everybody's energy is at the same frequency and then that resonance is what is really powerful. So being powerful is actually being able to influence and um, get the team to resonate. Toughest, obviously, was the first wave of COVID. I'd just taken over as CEO and the pandemic hit and, you know, all hell broke loose and it was a very unusual, there was no, no formula. Nobody had ever been through some, anything like that. Nobody knew what would happen. And I think um, the factors that really helped me was uh, I think resilience, patience, empathy, uh, not getting very worked up about the future, taking one day at a time, uh, listening to people, talking to people, Mm, I think that helped a lot. In uh, 2012, I was uh, marketing head of Brand Titan and I was given the role of the regional business head for the company, for all divisions of the company, for the South region. It was a new role. It wasn't even there earlier. And that, act, that and I did that role for three years. And uh, that role really opened up for me, you know, for me in my head, as well as for other people that, uh, you know, becoming a business leader as opposed to a functional expert in marketing was something that was truly exciting, very rewarding, and something that I was good at. Uh, and uh, it kind of really opened up a lot of possibilities for me. I don't do anything special. I, I'm just the way I am. I think uh, it helps that, uh, like I said, um, it's a Titan has a very... Uh, inclusive culture where everybody's voice counts and uh, it's now really my role and responsibility to make sure that other people's voices are heard my position and my designation is automatically opening the doors it's actually more how do i get other people to to speak i think uh, the one advice i would give is don't fret over small things and uh, it's a constant, at one level, you, you know, one is making progress and moving ahead, but oftentimes in life, you feel you've moved forward two steps and moved back one step and uh, not to get too disturbed by it and to continue, um, you know, moving, the momentum will carry you through. And I think that would be something that uh, I, I um, especially for me, when my kids were young, I used to get quite frustrated, not frustrated is the wrong word, I used to get um all worked up about small things, examinations, illnesses, and touch wood now they're grown. So now I look back fondly, but at that point of time, it wasn't uh, easy. I own about 25. I have, of course, uh, watches in Titan. I have Raga, I have several Ragas. I have uh, Xylus, a couple of Xylus. I have Tommy and Figure. That's also a brand that we market. Sonata, Fast Track, Smart Bands, uh, Hearables. So have the whole range. Um, personal favorite would be the Edge. I think uh, the Titan Edge is very quintessential Titan. It's uh, sharp. It's elegant. It's um, minimal. It's uh, right for every occasion. Uh, and I, I love wearing the edge.